Today is March 3, 2021, Wednesday. I'm here in front of the altar and I just pray already a while ago that the guy will get the box. Um, I'm hoping that it's just safe on the way here in Worthing and also going back to London to bring those three bucks that, that uh, I plan to send to Kagenor City. And now I'm going down to include the box that I uh, plan to send it and the person will get today from the LBC cargo. They will just get the box. And supposed to be this already sent last year but because of the COVID and that's the reason I wasn't able to make it. And I just get all of those inside in the box because of um, it's already expired. So I decided this year, 2021, to send this to the Philippines. That's, um, this is the first box. Um, I plan, um, that's bulky already. That one, number two, and then number three. I put that newspaper there because of the, the bike that I just, my bike I just put on top because there's no space here. It's very small, this, this place here down. And the other bike is, that's the bike of Peter. So I just uh, uh, put in there. Um, I'm just waiting the guy will come. That's the door. And that can press maybe or I just out press this bike of Peter. Go out. And then the next is my bike. Or that one can press maybe. Let me see when the person comes. And he's the one who said it. Maybe I, I think that compress this bike. Last time, I mean long time, when I send the box, there is a bully lit box in the Paris cargo, but this time no more. But that was long time. I put in here, the, uh, I think I'm doing like this. I put the box there and also this bike on top. And there are small box also in here, which means the, the bully lit for the Paris cargo. And then, um, I think in one go, nine. I think in one go, nine. And there's another, in that year, and then there's another on that year as well. I sent also in the Philippines, large box. I usually doing the, I never get a jumbo box in Paris, only in Putin International Cargo. I just get once because of the wheelchair that's supposed to be just uh, uh, give it, I mean, um, put it at home to use mama, even even the mama saw the wheelchair, but I just want to have another one, so that's still supposed to be, but was able to make it because mama died last November 1, 2016. So what I did, I bring that in Cagayan into the, you know, the grave, mama. Um, that was um, 2017 when I went to the Philippines. And then uh, I asked mama that this one, this new wheelchair will give it to Nani. At that time, they're in Komoot Island. So the the wheelchair that he's just using is still at home, but I don't know if it's still okay with that. Because I'm just thinking that brand new one, keep it at home. If it's somebody, you know, we don't know that they sick or what, they needed it. So we have wheelchair that they can use it by our neighbors. That's I plan for. So we have two wheelchairs at home, supposed to be. But I don't know if my brother is in look and take care of the old wheelchair that uh, using mama at that time and is still alive I don't know if it's still okay there because I have no idea by the time I went to the Philippines I just uh, you know uh, look at those uh, things in my room some of those I just get it and bring it to Cebu some I just bring in Kamut Island give it to somebody there cousins friends or relatives or sometimes uh, in Cebu as well I doing that so I don't know if that wheelchair there in Kagan is still okay or not but the brand new one, we give it to Nani in Kamut Island. So, Nani Nita. Oh, no, 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 Nani Sita. The other one who look and take care of me. When I was still a toddler, the same as my brother and my eldest brother, Marciliano, um, Manung Dudong, who they passed away 2005. So, that's the reason why I just uh, beat you a little bit, because I know uh, this is the three box LBC, uh, you know, Express this balik bayan box three box send it to the Philippines. My first time in Cagayan, but a lot only in Cebu. Usually, I just uh, I love Paris cargo, I like also LBC because it's okay when they deliver there in Cebu. And then, uh, usually, Paris cargo and put in international cargo, international cargo mostly in Cagayan City when Mama's still alive at the time, even though 
mama is uh, is gone already is already died but i still send box there at home in kageno city but that's parix cargo not not anymore other other cargos but this time this three will be sent to kageno city in my place there so some of those things in there are my stocks oh i mean you know collection which is my things that I put as decoration or whatever we call it, you know. I just put that in my small room there. But because I have a project there, I call it um, with the help of my nephew. Well, that's that's the one that I just call it, you know, a bodhika. A small only, a small room, close. I want it close because, you know, we cannot trust. You know, can trust, you know, any place that, especially not there, like that, you know. So that's the reason I, I make it close, look like a bodhika in her own dialect. But um, there's a window, but only decorated. So that's the one I decided that uh, all my things will put in there, including this. Uh, some of those as well. Well, I give it to those people who help us in my side. Be it, it me, me, you know, I'm talking about uh, somebody, you know, who help us um, at home. And those people I trust. And those people are in my side because they're people, you know, I would say we cannot make our, you know, it was cut. I'm just using the, my, you know, hands and uh, I get, you know, close that. <laughs> That's why it was cut off. Um, I say that we cannot, what I'm just saying, I forgot to say it. Well, because it, it, was, it was cut, this one that I'm just filming here on the way go down. And um, I'm just thinking about um, what I just said. I, I'm really lost. The one that I just said. Oh, no. We cannot trust by at uh, this time, you know, the, especially the COVID. A lot are jobless. A lot are struggling this time. No matter who you are, you know. But we still pray to the Lord that we will be survived no matter what. As long as you're not a person uh, choosy or, um, you know, um, you cannot survive with that. If you're a choosy kind of person, you have to admit, accept whatever it is that you have. As long as not poisonous food, you still be alive. That's that's my opinion in my own, you know, views in life as of this time that we are on the you know the situation in entire planet Earth related to the the COVID. So uh, I'm just uh, a little bit only that just uh, that's a little box over there, that's small hole over there that's the letter box of peter in this plot seven we just leave so a few only that i discussed the related these things because i'm happy to send this to the people as i said some of my things i just put in there with these three box and some of those mostly a lot of those i give it so it was my nephew will distribute this host this person who helped us host this person that um you know who helped also my nephew related to the project the one I said that a small boutique or a small room that close so that all my things will be there inside. As I said a while ago, as of this time, um, we have to be careful also because uh, because a lot of jobless, a lot of, uh, you know, struggling this time. And some people may they commit something that not nice, you know, that they just uh, get money in, not in good way you know what i mean but i don't see it anymore in this video but as i said uh, the people know uh, maybe they just they did that because to support their family and how can they do it that then so led into i mean led into a a bad situation or whatever he just he just do it and it's not good it's not good um which means that we have to be careful ourselves that because all of us will pass away you have to be in hell the place of you know, like the place in lava, a volcano. You want that? We want to be the place in our Lord Jesus Christ. That's why we have to make ourselves good now. Repent whatever we just have bad happenings in the past. And at least that we're still alive. This is the right time that we have to be good. We have to help others if there's something you can help. Support others if there's something you can do. Whatever that you can make it at this time, especially all, all of us here in the entire planet Earth now are struggling a little bit to this COVID. We cannot travel. We cannot go straight away because we have lots of restrictions. And that's the reason why I wasn't able to went to the, the Philippines last December. Now, me and Peter supposed to be, will be there last uh, 
September 1, that's our departure. We have already a plane ticket at the time being back and forth, but sad to say, wasn't able to make it. We cancelled our flight, and so sad because they didn't refund it exactly. Just, just give it a small amount of money, and uh, the money that for our flight back and forth. Then for last December, Peter just permit me to go into the Philippines, but the only thing is, uh, wasn't able to, to, uh, I would say, uh, uh, decided to go because when I found out, a lots of requirements, documents that you just carry to show it in the airport, to show it mean arrival, to show it in the departure. I gonna make it with this with a lots of requirements that. You, you just uh, either go and bring all those and that's the reason why I decided to cancel my decision going to the Philippines last December 2020 so I think that's all that I just said because I'm a more more focused on the video there related to the box and I don't know if I still sending box uh, finger crossed maybe but that's question mark I think um, since 2009, the box that I sent to the Philippines, I think it's 70, 70 plus or nearly 80. That's including Cebu, Cagayan, and Camutis Island. All of those in all. Six, I think, cargos that I just uh, decided to try other cargos like that, you know. I think six, six already different cargos that I just try. But I stick to LBC cargo. Put in international cargo and Paris cargo because I have no comments with these three cargos. So I think that's all for now. The box in there, those are remaining, but some of those put in the box as well. Next time, finger cross. I'm not sure if I did, if I just do it, but some of those are empty. At those box there, that's the one. Some of those are empty, but. Some of those I put in the box as well. Next time, those there three box are already full, ready to pick up by the LBC cargo today. And hopefully, that will be a past noon time. That's what I said to, to him, that hopefully in the afternoon. So I'm thinking at afternoon because I cannot make it in the morning because, you know, I have insomnia. At this time, I sleep only as, as far as a day. I think I sleep only four hours today. So I will cover up that. It's not good. It's not good like that you cover up. That's what the doctor says. It's not good that you will cover up that. It should be what today, like especially 60 up years old, you should have sleep 8 to 10 hours. That's the way it is. Well, anyway, I think that's all that I just say. Just only I discuss certain things related to the box that I plan to send it and to the Philippines and they pick up these three box today. I guess that's all for now. Bye-bye.